Who shot you? We're going to hit the straight up facts over feelings, emotions, assumptions. We're going to go straight to the facts. The, the first leading evidence, the video and cell phone recording evidence that is not being represented. One to the head, one to the chest. channel had all of this information why they never talked about none of that 
all news reporters get the same audio that I got. That's how they get on the scene when you see them talking about what's happening. You don't see none of the news reporters on the scene of that. But yet, they're going with a whole different narrative than the information they have themselves. news reporter got their ears to the tapes and they hear officer down first thing they do is they get out their beds they put their clothes on and they get that camera put in their trunk or in their work vehicle that already has it in it and they go straight to the scene so all this is missing from the news channel And there is a white man. And every video they put in front of the whole country to see, you see a, a white male in the video, and then they, they deleted him out, but they didn't delete him completely. So in the four seconds, they, they need to show the rest of this flashlight guy. That they don't have, a, they're looking for a white male, but they don't have a description of him. But he's in the video, and somebody's got him on a cell phone. Cell phone right here. They're still trying to look into his phone, but they got a white male. She says she doesn't see anything. I mean, how can you just be looking for a white male all over the place? They're not just going to grab up random white males and they don't have a description. If he didn't have a description, because it looks like he was wearing something like what they wear. Now, when is anybody going to talk about this? Or the body cam footage, the real raw body, body cam footage. Who's going to talk about that? We want to talk about the conspiracy, but nobody want to talk about these facts right here. Official documented facts. Swamp in the area looking for a white male. No clothing description or anything. Just swamp in the area looking for a white male. 
Is this a predominantly black neighborhood? Because that's a very vague way to search for somebody. But when the narrative switched to ozone, they're looking for dreadlocks, yellow shirt. And they didn't even know what kind of car he had. They thought he had an Impala. But then after they looked through the body cam footage and then did some uh, comparison, he has an HRV, but they said they was looking for a CRV and it was like, you know, HRV is rare. But anyways, how did they switch the narrative? I guess after they, they, they couldn't find the white male that they didn't want to describe was wearing most likely dark shirt like a police officer and a flashlight yeah that 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 right there is all gone from the from the uh officer shooting scenario why did it disappear Madison Mulberry lockdown looking for a white male and that's it just a plain old white male no description no clothes not just a white male or it could be that was what they were looking for because they saw him in the body cam also and if he was supposed to be he was by himself <laughs> 